what is up guys um rich here and welcome back to a another day of another game now we played borderlands 3 earlier and um i believe they got the like did they hit the like go I, i'm not 100 percent sure but basically we're going to be doing a part two to borderlands 3 but this is separate for borderlands 3 this is actually a separate game and for people you know who know already but the people who don't um welcome to tiny tina tiny tina is a character kind of throughout borderlands i believe it was borderlands 2 if i'm not mistaken where she was kind of had her own little sub story subplot like as a dlc um and it was actually really cool she's also a cool character um it's kind of hard to go back to play borderlands 2 after playing you know uh you know obviously three and then this is kind of a game of its own it's things it's kind of hard to go back so if you guys actually wanted me to really go back, I know you guys love the Borderlands 3 content, but I don't know if I'm going to go back to Borderlands 2. Basically, this is a separate game where you have kind of magical powers. It's a little bit more like, kind of like live action role play, like, you know, LARP. Kind of just playing a role, playing a hero role, Dungeons and Dragons, you know, obviously you see her in the background, placing things in the game. It's kind of cool, and I kind of like the concept of this game. And I thought it would be interesting just to showcase this. So, sorry for the long intro. I just had to... It's kind of a lot to explain, to be honest. No. No. Um, what is... Uh... Oh, this is... Oh, crap. This is a... This is a DLC. Oh, my... Ah, uh, this is just the final battle for the main campaign. I'm pretty sure, um... I'm pretty sure there's a DLC because I saw the see I only have 28% done. I saw that there was a season pass and all this and all of that, but I don't think I think I'm I don't know if I have it or not. Okay, let's just try to travel here. Okay, so this is the way back. Um, okay, I guess we'll just uh we could just start here to be honest. <laughs> so it's actually really cool. Like I'm not even gonna lie. Who's the guy talking? Y'all hear that, right? Oh, these guns are so cool, man. Shock them. Just spam your spells. Just, yep, spam spells. You're a wizard. You're a wizard. Man, uh, lately, a lot of my games have been wizard-ish. I don't know if it's that many. But I know that there's a lot of these across maps. And the more that you find these, and the more that you, you know what I'm saying, unlock them or whatever... Yeah, she she just explained it. The better the loot, it basically increases your luck chance. Uh, it's not by much per one die, but when they add all together, obviously it's a it's like a big effect. So that I thought that was a pretty cool kind of feature in this game as well. You know, Gearbox does a really good job with these games. Um, I need that. Uh, let's just equip it over this. Oh, is this a frost pistol? Hmm, I'm a thousand percent sure that this frost pistol isn't really a part of the meta, I guess you can say. So it's like, like, we're going to see if it's actually good. Okay, I think we have to go down here, I believe. Yep, here we are. I don't think this is really that good, to be honest, like this pistol, but we'll, we'll, we'll see. We're going to try it in a second. If there's an enemy, there you go. Oh, no, nah, I'm lying. It it looks pretty solid so far. Let me see. Maybe some more enemies here. Okay, that one shot it. No, it just... It's kind of smacking these skeletons right now. All right, we're going to see. If, all right, this is the real test here. Okay, maybe against skeletons it's just stronger. Yeah, because I think ice is stronger, but... Okay, there's this thing is actually ripping I'm not even gonna lie oh here we go here we go here we go this is such a fun shooter looter like look at this man this is so fun oh spike traps let's go all right we're going to see if this actually uh, I'm 
I'm probably it's probably not gonna be the best and I, I really hope that all right this is the boss guys let's see oh god oh god that's not good that's not good all right it's time to I know he's tougher because this is like chaos mode I don't know what this is Ooh, run I definitely feel slower when I play Borderlands games. I've said that in, in the Borderlands 3 video. I definitely feel like, what you know I'm saying? Like, I just feel slow, man. I just. Oh. Right, give me that. Um, yeah, I don't know. I just, I think they're made to feel this way. But every time I play another game, like whether it's been, I've been playing Infamous, I've been playing, you know, Dragon Ball Z, uh, all these other games, I just, it just make I, I feel slow, you know? In this game, I feel very slow compared to all the other games that I play. And so this chaos, oh, this dude is kind of, okay, I'm a little rusty. I ain't gonna lie. Okay, 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 back up. There you go. There we go. Now it's dipping to his health. Woo. Woo. Oh man, this is fun. I, 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 I do miss the, like, the shooting aspect, the shooter looter. Because Borderlands, again, I just think they make the best shooter looters. Ooh. Or is it looter shooters? I don't, I don't know. Ah. And plus, I think this is like Chaos Mode 4 or 5. I can't. He's going to die there. Okay, or he's not going to die. Or I'm, a, I'm just an idiot. I'm just gonna hold up, make it dramatic. Ooh. Ooh, loot. Let's see, what is this? Um. I'm pretty sure I already have this, but I'm just gonna pick it up anyway. Okay. Um. Not bad loot. And basically, you know, it wouldn't be Borderlands if we didn't. Give it a sec. There it is. If we didn't kill ourselves to basically refarm the ball. Yeah, guys, that's kind of the name of the game when it comes to Borderlands. Um, once you kind of beat a story or beat a playthrough, in this game it's a little different. You get to the highest level, but once you get to the highest level or chaos level, I, I believe there's like 10 or 20. But once you get to the highest chaos level, you just go back and and beat these old bosses farm the loot farm the best stats farm the best roles and things of that nature that's kind of how borderlands have, has always been and it's also like an endless kind of fun thing to do and they always have good dlcs always have good add-ons things that kind of keep you interacted you know into the game i think with this game in particular tiny tina i did have some issues with like the kind of the co-op i know my every time i go into my menu screen to try to do a co-op you know gameplay or whatever or join random people in the lobby it's kind of very laggy and it just kind of really throws me off and so i just i think that's one of the things that really the only knock on this game it was just the interface you know so if the interface you know obviously got better and who knows maybe it has i haven't really been playing it like that but again when i was playing when i finished the story all this and that that was kind of a problem um with that being said it's been your boy rich um sorry i couldn't really showcase as much as i wanted to i am kind of on a time crunch i do know that you guys enjoyed borderlands 3 and i'm gonna have to finish that playthrough or go part by part because i know you guys are loving that but if you guys are interested in you know the kind of the fantasy version of borderlands this is tiny tina um feel free to to let me know in, in the comments or like a, like you know drop a like on the video and things of that nature because um honestly no seriously if you guys are interested, I would just reset or run a new playthrough, run a new story, and just run through it and, you know, and go, and, and go through it. So, um, that's just kind of like, you know, the, the point of this, the point of this is to get this game, you know. Okay, that was creepy. I'm not gonna lie. The point is just to pump out content for this game, to pump out walkthroughs for these games. And so if I have to reset my character to do so, then, you know. I'll do so, right? And uh, no big deal. Um, but yeah, no, seriously, um, I've kind of already beat the story, so that's kind of why I'm just I just go through kill bosses, upgrade my chaos level, blah blah blah. But um, 
yeah um hope you guys enjoyed and um yeah i'll just see you guys tomorrow reach out